What is a bird? There are about 9,000 species of birds in the world. They live in a wide range of habitats from deserts to polar ice. Birds are warm-blooded and are the only vertebrates that can fly apart from bats. All birds have a toothless beak and a body covering of feathers and lay hard-shelled eggs. Birds of prey. These daytime hunters use their long, sharp talons to strike and seize their prey and a hooked beak to tear up food before swallowing it. Birds of prey include eagles, buzzards, hawks and vultures. They eat a wide variety of prey, including other birds, mammals, fish, insects, reptiles and carrion. They have excellent vision and can spot far off prey and accurately judge long distances. Flightless birds. Over millions of years, many bird species have lost the ability to fly. Some of these birds are small and live on remote islands where they have few natural enemies. Others, such as ostriches, emus and rears, are much larger. They live on open plains and escape their enemies by running. Penguins are flightless birds that feed on fish. They have stubby wings that they use as flippers. Owls and night jars. The main difference between owls and birds of prey is that most owls hunt by night. Their eyes are sensitive and can see clearly even in dim light. Some owls have such good hearing that they can locate prey in complete darkness. Owls are found in all continents except Antarctica. Although not closely related to owls, night jars are similar in appearance and are also primarily nocturnal hunters. Game birds and pigeons. Game birds are heavily built birds with strong feet. They usually nest on the ground and their chicks can feed themselves soon after they hatch. Game birds can fly well but only for short distances. By contrast, pigeons can fly fast and far. All pigeons have a small head and a streamlined plump body. They nest above ground and their young cannot feed themselves when they hatch. Parrots. Most parrots are brightly colored and all have a powerful hooked beak. Their feet have two toes that point forwards and two that point backwards, giving them a tight grip. Parrots often live in noisy flocks. They are very long-lived and can survive for 50 years or more. Perching birds. Perching birds have three toes pointing forwards and one backwards. Their toes can fold around twigs and lock in position so they do not fall off. Perching birds are immensely successful and widespread. This is partly due to their ability to perch and partly to the small size of most species, which allows them to feed on seeds and insects, two of the world's most abundant kinds of food. Cuckoos and relatives. Not all cuckoo species lay their eggs in other birds' nests. In fact, two thirds of species build nests and rear their own young. Cuckoos have some interesting relatives, such as the Huatzin, whose young use their tail and clawed wings to help them clamber around in the trees. The colorful forest-dwelling Turacos are also related to cuckoos. Ducks, geese and swans. Compared to many groups of birds, ducks, geese and swans are easy to recognize. Nearly all have a flattened beak short legs and webbed feet. Most are strong flyers. Ducks, geese and swans spend much of their life on or near water. Collectively, they are often known as waterfowl. Herons and cranes. Herons and cranes belong to two different groups of birds, but they often look alike. Most of them have a long beak and neck and they stand upright on long legs. Cranes use their beak to probe the ground for food. 
herons wade into water and wait for fish and other animals to come their way. Hummingbirds and swifts. These two groups of birds are close relatives, but they fly and feed in quite different ways. Hummingbirds hover in front of flowers and sip nectar through their tube-like beak. Swifts speed through the air on knife-like wings, twisting and turning as they snap up their insect prey. Water birds. Most water birds have a sharp, straight-edged beak that is good for catching fish. Some water birds live close to the shore, but others travel across the oceans and return to land only to breed. Water birds also live inland on ponds, lakes and rivers. Sometimes these freeze over, and many freshwater birds have to spend the winter on the coast or in warmer parts of the world. Woodpeckers and toucans. These two groups of birds look different, but are close relatives. They both have feet with two toes pointing forwards and two pointing backwards. When they fly, they flap their wings in short bursts so that they rise and fall as they move through the air. <laughs> 